I gotta be next to you. bless you guys so today's video is going to be on this makeup look here um all i did was basically um put on some liner and then most of the eyeshadow was underneath my eye um so yeah i kind of did like reverse eyeshadow like eyeshadow down here and not up here um yeah i use this lovely palette i think it's called cocaine or cocaine palette from lula's cosmetics honestly you guys this palette is everything you're gonna see it in the video as i'm showing you guys how i apply my um my eyeshadow underneath here but honestly this palette is life like it really is and the oh my god it's so pigmented it's just so smooth i love this palette but yes so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below and hit that notification bell so you'll be notified the next time that i upload another video <laughs> okay guys let's just get started right into the tutorial Hey guys, hey guys, <laughs> I'm such a nerd, um, I was having so much fun that day um, recording this, but yeah, anyways, um, I'm going to take some um, a black liquid, no not liquid, black gel liner from L'Oreal, and that is in black is black, and I'm going to just line my eyes, do a nice little wing eyeliner, I love wing eyeliner, and it's my favorite to apply wing eyeliner with gel um eyeliner i always thought that like liquid was better like in like the pen but honestly it's me personally i find that i do my best wings when i'm using a gel eyeliner um as you saw i like to start in the inner corner of the eye and then i like to make the wing like the line first and i like to connect the two going like the opposite way and then i just go ahead and fill it in and um I clean it up <laughs> so if it's really messy don't worry you could just take some concealer and clean it up and you get that nice sharp beautiful sexy wing liner yes girl show it out now mm -hmm. okay <laughs> I love 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 I'm um, using gel eyeliner for um for a wing liner so now I'm gonna take my professional from benefit cosmetics and um, this is their matte rescue primer I love it so much it keeps your face feeling matte but not too matte so I definitely recommend this and then I'm gonna go in with my Mac match master foundation in 7.5 using my real techniques blending sponge I'm going to just pounce it pounce or that pounces into my face um i love this blending sponge so much it works wonders it like blends your makeup in very nicely and it doesn't leave you with like all this access like products on your face because sometimes you can put a little bit too much on your skin and i like that it kind of sucks that all up so now i'll be taking my Too faced concealer in deep tan there we go and i'll just be i'm um, using that same real technique sponge to just blend that all in as you can see i put it under my chin i put it on my chin upper lip under my eyes my nose and my forehead this just makes it like gives you like the illusion of like your face coming forward so all those places where you put the lighter colors is um your face gonna be coming forward and um, when you contour it's like it's sucking it in but yeah anyways i like to do that highlighting is life so now i will be taking my sephora bright set powder to just set all those areas um you want to make sure you set anything that's a liquid because it will just last longer you don't want to leave anything liquid liquid on your face unless it's a you know a lipstick or a lip gloss then that's different but if it's on your face you want to make sure that you set it so now i'll be taking my ramel sun shimmering bronzer and the color 002 sun love and i'll be using that to just um set the rest of my face so all the foundation areas like where i put my foundation i love this so much you guys i use it as a face powder even though it's a bronzer i mean it matches my color skin so why not <laughs> so now i'm going to be using my um fix plus from mac i like to spray my face in the middle of my makeup and then at the end so now i'll be taking lula's palette this is their cocaine palette i think it's called cocaine palette it is so beautiful you guys look at these colors they are amazing could you imagine wearing these colors like during the summertime woo, woo, woo. <laughs> so now i'll be taking the color intoxicate look how pretty that fuchsia pink is oh it is gorgeous um yeah so i'll be taking that color with my large blending sponge from um beach cosmetics and i'm gonna put that under the eye i'm just gonna make sure i blow it out as much as i possibly can so now i'll be taking the color vip 
oh you guys you guys see how pretty these colors are oh my gosh um i love it <laughs> the color vip um, i'm putting it underneath uh closer to my waterline and then i'll be taking the color sin city and putting it like really close to like my waterline and kind of blending um vip and sin city together um you guys these colors are so smooth and silky and pigmented they feel so good on the eye oh my gosh like they really killed it with this formula. I love it. So now I'll be taking some of that gel liner again and just going to line my waterline. I added some lashes. These lashes are from the beauty, beauty supply store. Sorry. Um, I forgot to put on mascara, you guys. I can't believe that, but I did. Anyways, I'm going to take um, Anastasia's bronzing powder in mahogany and uh, cover FX press mineral foundation in 120 and i'll be using those colors together to contour i don't really like the colors separately on, on their own but together i do think that it like it makes a perfect shade for contour for a dark skin girl so i definitely love it and um yeah i think it's so nice so pretty i gotta make sure i snatch the chin now snatch the chin okay <laughs> even though i'm happy that my double chin has disappeared a lot um but it's always good to snatch your chin you know um it just makes everything look nice and chiseled you know what i mean it just like really finished and just put together i don't know i love doing it so now i'm gonna be taking that bright set powder to just kind of carve out the contour areas that i did this just helps it to look really nice and sharp um, I seen a couple girls on YouTube do it once and I was like, let me give it a try and I absolutely love it So this is a definitely like a really good trick to like if you want your contour to be like super snatched I'm gonna also do it to my nose. Um, this is when you want your nose to be super snatched as well You basically just put some of that bright set powder on there and then you leave it to sit for a while So you just don't touch it. You leave it to sit for a while Um, and then you wipe it off at the end So I'll be taking Anastasia's blush kit ingredient and I'm gonna apply that to the cheeks you guys This blush kit is amazing I'm obsessed with it. I don't use any of the blush, but this blush kit, like, blah, blah, blah. I can't even talk, but this brush, blush kit, oh my gosh, I love it. So as you can see here now, I'm just wiping it all off, and it made it look a lot more snatched in my opinion, and just more, like, carved out. So now I'll be taking my favorite highlighter from Bobbi Brown in Bronze Glow, and I'm going to just highlight the cheekbones. Look how popping it looks. Oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. I love it. <laughs> Ooh, I had to put my hair on, you know, put the wig on, put the wig on. And now I'm going to be lining my lips with MAC Chestnut Lip Liner. Chestnut Lip Liner. Why can't I talk today, guys? With Chestnut Lip Liner. Um, This lip liner is life. I use it for every color, everything that I do. If I'm putting anything on my lips except for red, I'm using the slip liner. It's so bomb. So now I'll be taking Lula's Cosmetics Hybrid Shine. It's a duo. It has a lip gloss and a lipstick, you guys. This is so pretty. But today, I just really just wanted to use the lip gloss, you know, because I'm obsessed with lip gloss. I love lip gloss. Lip gloss is life. Um, it's a nice, like, white, glittery color, but it kind of, like, blended in with um, my lip liner. But it's okay. Anyways, I'm going to spritz my face with some Fix Plus now, and the look is complete. <laughs> Okay guys, and that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial. I absolutely love this look. Um, I love the eyeshadow at the bottom. I didn't um, expect for my lips to be brown. Like, <laughs> I thought I was gonna do like a, like a clear, like, glittery gloss because that's what um the lip gloss i used from lula's cosmetics it was clear glittery but i ruined it by putting on um lip liner i put on chestnut lip liner by mac and it kind of just all fused together and made this like shiny brown lip gloss i guess um yeah like i'm not mad at it but i wasn't looking for that color i was more looking for just for me to be you know rocking the the clear lip gloss but nonetheless it does look nice like I'm not gonna lie um I don't hate it but I did want it to be like clear you know I wanted it to be clear but um yeah I added the lip liner and then it just turned brown <laughs> but yeah guys I love you guys so much um don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as well as hit that subscribe button down below and don't forget to hit that notification bell and I will see you guys in my next one <laughs> okay guys bye